It's been a great opportunity to have uh, Cameron Hill here today uh, getting a taste of the Fleet Air Arm and Navy Aviation, drawing some comparisons between uh, racing and exactly what we do here in the Navy. Oh, it was unreal to get a tour around the base and, and see the maintenance work with all the um, different aircraft. A lot of crossover, you know, between um, what we do in motorsport as well, you know, some of the tooling and, and equipment that they've got. Um, so really, really cool to see um, and yeah, just a lot of um, hard-working people there that really, you know, get stuck in with their hands and solving all sorts of different problems. So as an aviation technician, uh, we are part of a team, a small team that goes to sea with a 60 Romeo, 13 maintainers and six aircrew. Uh, much like a racing team, we're there to keep that aircraft at peak performance so that it can uh, do what it needs to do uh, at sea with the ship. Um, the good news is you don't need any experience at all to be an aviation technician. Navy will give everyone the training they need. So essentially it's about an 18 month to two year period of training. Uh, we do a bunch of basics at our initial training school and then we come and learn uh, the trade on the 60 Romeo aircraft here at Albatross. Apprenticeship training is, is a great way to start a career. Uh, and even those people who already have a career in the aviation trades can join the Navy and, uh, and apply their trade here with the, with the Seahawks.